In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to make a really fast, easy beat. Go to FL Keys or whatever your keyboard VST or plugin is in your DAW. Turn the tempo to 107. I don't know why, maybe 105. We're gonna make one of those slower tri type tracks. Turn your metronome on and just go. I'm just gonna use, again, three notes for simplicity. Let's just do F, A flat, and C. Um, probably go like F minor and then <clears throat> just count down half steps. E, E flat, D, D flat. So from the F to the fourth. See what happens. Okay, another thing is I'm going to make the uh, number of, <clears throat> I'm gonna make it like one bar, I think. Let's see. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna do 64. All right, here we go, let's see how that sounds. Something real simple. Uh oh. Let's see what happened. When I quantized it, it moved over too much. All right, so we're going to put this on halftime just to give it a different feel, see what it sounds like. Clone it, copy this one, paste it right back. Try that instead. Copy this line, bring it down to the C sharp. Same notes. Okay, you can clone again the FL keys and now just do like a counter melody of any sort. 
Those same notes, F, A, and C. So it's kind of like a counter melody. So let's put some reverb on that just so that it uh, can be distinguished. And then we'll raise the octave. So now the what am I trying to say? Now the um, melodies are higher than the drums. We don't want that. So we want to <clears throat> mix everything down. A basic mix, all right? So the the kick can be kick should peak around negative six. The bass should probably. sub 15 just depending on what you want you can vary that for sure claps and remember I'm looking at this area over here to determine where it's peaking and then the keys should be down and around here and under a lot of people have their melodies and stuff up here peak with their drums and they wonder why their beats don't have that punch. Did that for years. So this is basic, it's not nothing life changing, it's just it'll, it's just an idea to get you started, right? From here you can add your glitches, your effects, your transitions, your hi-hats, your your effects, your percussions. On your percussions and just your additional drums, put them on the upbeats. That helps a lot. we got so I don't really have all my sounds here I just have a super basic kit that I always just keep to do just do fast stuff but if I really wanted to get into it I would add um, a lot of like more percussions effects transitions you know just those So this one is shot. I know that. Um, I don't know if it's the automation or what. Anyway, that one is shot now. So if you want to arrange it, a very quick way to arrange it is to then bring all the tracks to your playlist, whatever DAW you're using, uh, copy it over. Usually an intro will start with just the with just the melodies.
bring the hook in right there, actually. Four drum kit packs from certified producer all our own. Go ahead and click the link to download those. 